I'm a little bit of a pyromaniac. Um, I, I, I really like fire. But ever since, since childhood, I've loved candles. I've loved the of candles. I've loved uh, the, the, the various colours of the flame and so on. Um, and there's, there's a special trick that you can do with candles because the hottest part of the candle is, is just above where you can see the visible flame. So if you're quick, you can put your fingers straight through the candles. But I love fire, and this is this is a kind of running theme in the first two books. So there's always. Not always, but very commonly I, I use the, the idea of fire as a, as a, as a gateway which leads to something else, whatever it is. So this one is about fire works. It's called powder. The flint hesitates, but this is damp, blue touch paper, heavy with oil, cramp in the fingers, black powder on the soft brown earth. The battery stands, box of it, a cork stuffed with the grubs of rockets, Nerves of nitrate strain on each curve, styrations poised on the crackle of my thumb. The span of sky is nearly into night, the fan of heaven trimmed, the light crushed into a flat of endless lines. The incomplete waits for the perfect until I send the white rulers of flame, until the fire on earth goes godbound tracing million crosses in chemicals against the darkness of the sun. And yet, no delay. The powder shimmers for the time when I light the sky on St. John's Day. Then the dancing girls with scarlet in their tresses will teach me the origin of fire. <coughs> <coughs> 